So, welcome back to the Wandering Northerner channel. We are back at one of our usual places, looking at the Universal site in Kempston Hardwick. There's been a further change to the housing here, so we're going to walk past the ones that are occupied. So that starts with 12 and 11. They're both occupied, so we're not going to pay any attention to those. And then as we get to number 10, 10 looks like it's been abandoned for a number of years. I'm going to guess it hasn't been bought yet by Universal because there's no sign of it being boarded up. But you can see there that house hasn't been occupied for a long time. As we get to number 9, again number 9 has now got signs that's been boarded up. Again, we're going to walk past eight, seven, six, these all appear to be occupied. Number five always looks pristine. I, know, I think that is occupied still. This one is. <clears throat> now we get to the, the famous house number three. Clearly boarded up. Number two, it's been common knowledge for a while that this one's empty. Somebody's using the bin. Then we get to the annex, number one, also empty. And I believe number one is now empty as well. No signs of life here, nothing seems to be changing. The chap at number one, who I'd spoke to a few times, seems to have moved on. Which is a shame, so the houses here are starting to vacate. This is the, the main road to the site, Manor, Manor Road. Currently we're waiting to hear from the council. They said it at the end of September at a meeting that they were expecting the SDO to come through, which is special development order. Nothing's really happening on site at the moment. Once they get that special development order, there's a 30 day process where the council will only be able to comment, it'll be dealt with by the government. So, we really we should hear before December what is going to happen here. You can see in the distance there's a blue tube. So, this is the main part of the site. This is a uh, rather large field. I put some drone footage in here. See here this new blue tube where they've drilled down to test something. It's in the middle of the field. No, can't see any others. So yeah, just to uh, finish off here. Now number one appears to be empty. That leaves one house occupied in this first group of houses. Hopefully the, the chap that lived there got the money he needed. Uh, I'm sure these will all be, by the spring, will be all unoccupied. And if the special development order is granted, we should quickly see designs for a theme park, hotels, 
parking and everything else here. The council have said they've already seen the uh, special development order in draft. It's not going to be a surprise to them when it does arrive. So I expect we'll see movement quickly. And uh, very big changes on this site in Kempston Hardwick. Thanks for watching all. Do subscribe to keep up to date. See you soon.